running your own business, I think uh, you, you enjoy that. You like the responsibility of organising things and knowing that it's really up to you. You know, if anything goes wrong in the end, it's really your fault. Uh, hi, my name's uh, Lachlan Shulman. I'm the owner and run Mansell IPM Services. We are based in Western Australia, just north of Perth. We have a crop monitoring service that checks for insects and diseases in horticultural crops. And also we run an insectary where we produce three types of uh, beneficial insects and mites. IPM, Integrated Pest Management, is incorporating uh, beneficial insects that you introduce, natural ones that come in, and then using softer chemistry. So not using broad spectrum insecticides and just killing every insect out there and predator. It's about specifically targeting the worst insects with, with some soft sprays and, and using your beneficials and the monitoring the crop and knowing exactly what insects and diseases are, are in the crop at a present time. In my job, what I'm responsible for is the insectary, so growing the beneficial insects. I mean, at stages, we'll have between three to five people working at the insectary. And then the monitoring side, and there's around two to three of us that are out there in the fields that are monitoring the crops. So I'm basically on the road at about seven o'clock, and we'll probably check around three farms during that day and try and get back around four to check on the insectary. And then after we've sent all the orders out, basically going to be checking emails and, and looking at the next day's work. I went to University of Queensland at Gaddon. I did a um, three-year degree production horticulture there. And in my fourth year, I did an honours in basically entomology into IPM in strawberries. I worked pretty much full-time for an IPM consultant, so I learnt skills in the monitoring and interaction between predators and pests. I think I did work experience in probably six, seven places, research places, production areas, did some overseas. And I decided to have a look around Australia where I could possibly go and, and maybe start my own business. And I spoke to some people at the Ag Department in, in Western Australia, and they stated that there was no one over here doing any consulting, and predators hadn't really been used much in Western Australia. So about seven years ago, I ventured over for a week and, and visited about 10 growers and got a little bit of interest, but I decided to move over to, uh, to Western Australia and Perth. Running your own business, I think you enjoy that. You like the responsibility of organising things and knowing that it's really up to you. Uh, qualifications and experience that is needed to uh, be an IPM consultant probably it would help you to have a diploma or, or even a degree but whatever study you do it's, it's based around horticulture so you can learn the principles of growing a crop and then actually in that course to do some entomology and, and also pl plant disease work um, to be able to identify common insects common diseases and also to, to learn a bit about chemicals would be really really valuable um, when you come to the experience most of that can be learnt basically in the first few weeks of, of bug checking. Probably the rewards uh, for the crop consultant financially, if you can monitor, you know, probably 30 to 40 farms a week, you know, maybe eight months of the year, you probably could, could look to earn, you know, between 70 to $80,000 a year. Australia needs a lot more IPM consultants out there. The crop consulting is definitely an area where there's a lot more growth that can take place.